Hello everybody. Hi everybody. Welcome to Brow for Clock. I'm Sarah. And I'm Melinda. And we are the Boo Sisters from Oz Oz Oz. Very theatrical. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> well, it is Pride Month after all, so mm. yeah, yeah. Just, you know, putting it out there because you're allowed to be theatrical. <laughs> and that's okay. good. So, welcome. What do you think? Different venue. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. So, guess where we are tonight? Mm. Can you guess? Mm. No. Nah. We're at Arnie Lindy's. Mm. <laughs> and you keep going. And you're having a sleepover tonight. Mm. How exciting. So exciting. Mm. <clears throat> what were you going to say? <laughs> oh. So I poured a <laughs> giant glass of wine. <laughs> And we popped a bit of ice in it because it was straight out of the wine rack. Mm. And um, so, yeah, Melinda put some ice in it. It was like, <laughs> you know, it smells like garlic. Mm. We think that maybe whoever made the ice last time might have just finished chopping the garlic and didn't wash their hands. Possibly. Because that's pretty bad. Yeah. But these glasses are huge. That's yeah. well, what I poured. It's about a half a bottle of wine. So I'm going to put up with the That's garlic. Right. My my ginger. Mm. My v vodka and ginger is a bit garlicky mm. too. I think the ginger's strong enough. Mm. Mm. Ginger. It's not ginger. It's garlic. No, oh, ginger, ginger ale. Strong yeah, yeah, the ginger beer. Yeah. That it mm. overpowers your garlic. <laughs> mm. I'm not sure. Yeah. I wonder if the mm. um if the ice absorbs. Like garlic bread smell and that sort of thing. I don't know. I don't know how that happened. It's pretty foul, but it's weird, you know, yes. don't let some garlic get in the glass. No, nah. don't let some garlic get in the way of a glass of wine. Oh, that's right. That's what my my brain was thinking. My yes. Yeah, anyway, so um, go can on. take a breath off. Oh yes, <laughs> please. Oh. Actually, I haven't had mine on for that long today, and I got dressed after lunch. That's right. <laughs> I had to put mine on this morning because we had to duck to the shops, remember? Mm. So I did the – I sacrificed my breasts on a, on a weekend morning. Yes. Yeah. So I've had mine on for like ages. For hours. Yes. Not like the, the other day. Was that no, that was – what did you crazy. say? 14 like hours or something. 15, I think, because it was you know, 8.30 or something. Ridiculous. Oh, come on. There's too many layers. We're going to have to come up with a better plan through we winter. Are. Oh, there it's coming. Oh, oh. oh. Maybe, just, maybe just we can. Just a moment. Yep, okay. Maybe we can what? I don't know. Just come up with a better plan. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I've got a pretty one on tonight. Oh, do you have done <laughs> your jacket? No, I don't. Oh, I've got fancy. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. my word. You were going to say the L word, weren't I you? I was, I was. <laughs> oh, my lord. My lordy lord. I don't think he had anything to do with you getting a bra off. No, I don't think he did. No. Anyway, so, um, oh, see? Now yeah, you match. You match. You can be the bra unicorn, like the, the camel of the unicorn family. The with the With the two humps. Two humps? It's better than one. <laughs> You can beat an egg. Anyway, so right. we're at Auntie Lindy's house tonight. So exciting. So exciting. Having a sleepover. Mm -hmm. We've got fireplace on inside. Oh, roaring inside. Oh, we arrived mm. so warm. Mm. Good job, sister. Thanks. Mm. Just doing what I can. Keeping the family happy. Were you going to cheers? Yeah, sure. Cheers. Why not? Mm. Mm. We've got the beautiful uh, solar fairy lights in the Aww. background. It's kind of got the, the hanging now. I wonder how that'll turn mm -hmm. out mm -hmm. on the film. I wonder if we've got to see the fence underneath. I don't think so. It'll just be magical. Yeah. Magical fairy lights, lights with the unicorn. Yeah, so um Go, yeah, through the fairy you're lights. You're looking a bit a bit fancy. Yes. Well, seeing as uh I didn't put makeup on today. I did put a little bit of lippy mm -hmm. on for the show. Um 
And actually, your, your lip is a little bit different. What's going on there? I know. What I happened? forgot to bring my lipstick. My but, lipstick. I wear the same lipstick. Well, so do you. Yeah. But uh, I like my lipstick. Mm. But anyway, this is um, <clears throat> only Lindy came up with a bit of a substitute for right. me. Right. But you didn't forget the vodka and the wine. No. <laughs> so I'm a bit proud of you, really. Mm. You, know, you got you got your priorities right. Yeah. Yeah, sacrifice the lipstick as long as we've got the alcohol. Mm. All is okay. All Wine will be and forgiven. Mm. And a fire, a roaring fire. What more do we need? I know, right. And you're about to cook me dinner at my place. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, right. How awesome is uh, that? Mm. Yes. Let me tell you a funny story, right? Mm. So I don't know what you'd call this dinner. In the recipe, it's called stuffed chicken breast. Oh. But. Um, look, I've tried a million times. I just can't cut a breast to put stuffing in it. No. And quite honestly, I don't like chicken breast anyway. No. So we use, um, generally speaking, we use chicken thighs. Mm -hmm. And so I just lay them all out in the bottom of the baking tray. And then I make the um, mix, which is just some cream cheese and spinach and salt and pepper. Mm. Just Beat that up. Delicious. So yummy. And mm. I just lay that over the top. That's right. And I think the first time we did it in a small dish and we actually just put a second layer of breast on, but that just took too long. So mm. now we just put the um, thighs on the bottom, yep. the yummy stuff that's supposed to be stuffed <laughs> inside it. We just lay it out on top. The stuffing. Yeah. Gets laid on top. Yep. Yep. And then you, I just usually put some baking paper or some, or not baking paper, the silver stuff. Alfoil. Aluminum. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Mm. Alfoil. Yeah. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, whack that in the oven mm. for however long, pull it out, mm. sprinkle a bit of cheese on under the grill. Oh. It is so good. So good. <laughs> so good. And because it all sort of melts through, doesn't it, to the, like, so you've got, like, this sauce. The stuffing, yeah, yeah. melts down around the chicken. That's, it's mm. so much better. It's, yeah. So good. I couldn't imagine it in salt. I know. how You wouldn't get enough. Although, and I, I think I think your chicken would dry out as well. Mm. At least with the stuffing on top, it kind of keeps it moist. Yes, and if you use thighs, at least you eat yummy chicken. Yes, meat. yeah, yeah. I don't care much for the breast no. of a chicken. It, that's right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> oh, you're a country. That's no good. Oh uh, what? I said okay, I can't drink, and I said and that's no good. No, no, <clears throat> no. You got to anyway. stop laughing now. So you have chicken in my fridge this morning, mm. and Lindy's over having a coffee, and she says, "Oh, are you are you having your not stuffed chicken thighs?" <laughs> I said, "Yes." She went, "Oh, okay." I'll put the fire and, on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I said, "Do you want us to come over and cook your dinner?" Yes, please. Yes. So here we are. Because my husband's at work too, and so. She won't eat. No. When her husband's at work, if he hasn't pre-cooked her dinner, just uh, be right. A few coffees. Mm. Yeah. Like, it's not like it doesn't hurt me, you know. Wow. Oh. <laughs> at work yesterday, I think. Yeah. And uh, the, the girl that's leaving that I'm replacing, she says, oh, <laughs> I, I forgot my lunch. So I stopped at the servo and bought a sandwich. And I thought, hmm. Mm. I think I'd rather starve, but mm. um, actually it didn't look too bad. But anyway, she said, and I got some some chockies, you know, mm. they were two for six dollars or something. Right. And she said, how, you know, how could you resist? Exactly. And she said, so, you know, a bit later on, if you fancy either of those. I said to her, do I look like I don't like chocolate? Yeah, right. And she laughed, you know, yeah. even when you like that with people yes. for the first time, they're a bit, oh, like, yeah. oh I, I didn't mean to say you're fat. Or, no. Do I look like I want the sandwich as yeah. opposed to the chocolate? <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. If I'm having sugar, give it to me and chocolate. I don't want it out of your dirty no. white bread. That's what hubby mm. says when we go to the pub mm. or wherever. But generally, it's the pub and we'll order our steaks. And he orders steak, chips, no salad mm. with uh, garlic, creamy garlic sauce mm. twice. Two, yeah. Like two lots two, of sauce. Two thirds. And... Uh, and every time, well, now they know us down there, but at other pubs that we don't frequent, mm. the waiting staff always says, so no salad? Mm. And my beautiful hubby says, 
do I look like I eat salad? <laughs> and the same, that same sort of awkward, oh, oh, mm. yeah, it's hilarious. They're thinking, no, you're fucking dying. No, exactly, yeah. that's exactly what they're thinking, <laughs> yes. <laughs> and then I'm sure, then I say, then my turn, so I'll say, you know, steak, I'll have the salad and the chips, mushroom gravy for me, thank you. Mm. Um, and, you know, it's like, oh, so you want the salad? I said, I know. It looks like I'm, <laughs> I don't eat, salad, I don't eat either. salad either, but I actually quite enjoy the salad. Yeah. I like the salad as long as it's not that, you know, cold, dry. Oh, cold what is that? I don't know. It's not salad. What is that? Mm. I can't believe they're serving that and charging people. It's either that or it's that shit on the side of the plate that looks like it should just be a garnish. Yes. But yeah. they oh, call yeah. it salad. They call it that, yeah. Yeah. And it's just full of onion. Mm, onion and uh, cucumber a vinaigrette. Oh, too much. <laughs> uh, just like, give just, me the rare steak. Yeah, mm. that's right. Oh, is it light flickering? I think it, when I want to go like that. Oh, that's yes. our, we'll our stop, spotlight. We'll stop banging or I'll have a We're in seizure the spo- on you. Oh, yeah, goodness. <laughs> we're in the spotlight. So Because we're at Annie Lindy's. Yes. I didn't bring all the things. I forgot. So we have a little box that our lappy mm. sits on. We've got, as you all know, our new fancy... Beautiful stage lighting. Yeah, stage mm-hmm. lighting in mm-hmm. my house. So I've gone, oh, we've put the lappy open. It's mm. down there. Like, oh, it's hi, down there. Down like, there. yeah. And it's dark. And, yeah. Anyway, I think we did all right. Did really mm. well. And that light is really um, catching on your horn. Right. I'm <laughs> your pleasing. horny little bugger. I know. I was trying to say to your daughter before, I was going in there saying, let me spray some magic on you. Mm-mm. She didn't like it. Oh. Like, no, that's what comes out of a unicorn horn, is magic. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just going to all the wrong places with you, spraying magic with your horn. So, <laughs> and I'm trying not to picture oh. my daughter having anything to do oh. with your magic spraying horn. So disgusting. I know. But, oh. you know, we could do it. We, <laughs> yep, yeah, No. <laughs> I was going to say we could do the adult version of, um, you know, magic horns. And sometimes magic does come out of them. Mm. That's right. Magic oil. Like, yeah. Was it really when cool? when two people love each other very, very much. <laughs> when a mummy and a daddy. daddy that's right. <laughs> love well, each other very much. Oh, well, it doesn't even have to be that anymore. It's just when two people love each other very much. Well, that's much. right. That's what it was when we were kids. That's all right. Yeah. Just, they don't have to love each other. No, when they two don't. people do it together, they've yeah. got their horn on, magic yeah. shit happens. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Babies are born. Or not. Or sometimes not. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. yeah, use protection sure. if you don't want a baby. Yeah, or you don't want an STI. That's right. Mm. We've talked about that a couple yeah. of times now. Maybe we've got issues there. No, we're just safe sexes. Oh, we're, <laughs> we're being responsible Middle-aged women. Yeah, we're being responsible influencers. Oh, yes, Ooh. we are. You like that? Mm. Do you know, my daughter. I mm. know, oh, that's what made me think of it. Told me the other day that we were influencers. Mm. I can't remember why that was. No. No, we're just talking shit, mate. Talking smack. Talking smack. Um, yeah, I, let's see, I can't remember. You sound like me. Start a oh. story and then go, oh. Mm. Then, oh, oh then I might look over there you. for a little while. Yeah. Well, that's Shiny beautiful. You talk. Things. I'm going to look yeah. over there. Oh, well, I'll come back Don't in a minute. Don't to play with your hair a little bit. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I can do that because I'm a magical unicorn. So cute. See the little pink and blue bits of hair in there? You've oh. even got pink bits around your horn. I do. Uh, do you remember when I went a couple of years ago, I went to a rave Yes, people, a rave with my daughter. Um, Sorry, I've got an itchy nose. Uh, uh, It's not. (sighs) Yeah, nice. It's It's classy. Keeping it classy. I bought some tissues out for this exact reason so we weren't snorting all over our show. Sorry. (laughs) Oh, that's beautiful. It's nice. It's, uh, what do you, what, it's different, it's unusual. It's nice, different, it's unusual. Yeah. So I went to a rave with my daughter. It was a 90s rave. Yeah. So we had to Google, like, what do you wear to a 90s rave? I don't know. I've never been to one. Oh, I've so. I've never been to a rave. Oh, so good. So not cool. Well, we're only there for a short time, but that's another story. Mm-hmm. Uh, got in, even though I was, like, the oldest person there. <laughs> um, 
boogied on the dance floor. Showed with, the young'uns how to move. So, I so mm. did. And all walks of life there, let me tell you mm. people. It was so cool. But I ended up going, I went and bought myself a unicorn wig. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Oh, so it was like white hair with the ears mm. and the horn and everything. And then, um, I don't know, went to Kmart, bought one of the $3 white shirts. Oh, and yes. Bought some glow sticks. Yes. And cut them and then splashed like mm. the neon juice mm -hmm. all over the white. So, because I figured there'd be some blue mm. light there or black light or whatever that's called when your neon stuff glows. Yeah. And um, so, you know, there I am on the dance floor boogieing away because nobody would, none, nobody who I went with would dance with me. And it was such cool music and all the beautiful people on the dance floor and I just wanted to be part of it. Mm. So I'm out there and I'm dancing, busting a move, move, mm, busting a move, busting a move yeah. cutting the carpet. Mm. And this beautiful lady comes over to me and she's like, she starts patting my my white wig. <laughs> was she tripping? So I think she was tripping massively, right? <laughs> she says, I can't believe you're here. I can't believe you're here. And I said, oh, well, I am. And I've never, ever met this woman before. Mm -hmm. And I said, what, what makes it so good that I'm here? And she said, I really wanted to meet a unicorn tonight. Oh, you'd think she was tripping. I'm you, pretty confident yeah. that... And and you're here. Mm. She said, may I rub your horn? And <laughs> and it took me a minute because, like I said, all walks mm. of life. So I wasn't sure she thought I was, you know... If you had tr one down there. it for the night or whatever. And uh, so I, I went, I bowed to her and said, yes, you may. Oh, I thought she was going to cry. So Met that first unicorn. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're wonderful. Oh! Did you spray your magic? <laughs> <laughs> Can I rub your horn and then I spray <laughs> my magic on you, baby? Oh, she was a cutie. That's anyway, hilarious. so yeah, so I just kind of like did that mystical dance away from her. Did a bit yeah, of that. yeah, and sort of, and she just mm -hmm. watched me float away. Float away, yes. Aww. You were so you made <sighs> someone's night. I did. Yeah. I did as a unicorn. Yeah. Yeah, so that was lovely. It's a very lovely night. Mm. <laughs> An hour that we were there, but anyway, that's fine. The young'uns can't handle it. Young'uns can't handle it. Not then. Not then she couldn't. No. No. No stamina. No. That's right. Anyway. Anyway, so um, what have you got? You I got, got nothing. nothing. Oh, really? I'm writing down our hashtags as oh, I think of them. Oh, <laughs> nice. So I'll tell you the other day about when I went to the shops. Because we're shop we're doing a bit of shopping for an upcoming mm. celebration that we're having. Yes, yeah, stop banging the table, oh, mate. Sorry. I got a bit excited. Do. Um, yes, you yes. do. Yes. <gasps> yes. That is, that is something we should mention. That's, I'm so sorry. Um, so sorry. Because I speak correctly. So it, it seems to be that when I say my anything that has got an S in it, and especially yes, because I get so excited when Sarah is telling a story, <laughs> and I tend to say yes, and we realised watching the shows back that uh, I do sound a little bit like um, a snake having a seizure. It's uh, not that bad. <laughs> it's just yes, yes. It does. It seems more exaggerated yes. than I think. It, would normally be. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's hilarious. I don't know you're at the shops. I was at the shops <laughs> the other day. And uh, and the cash, I'm trying to pay, right? Mm. But, and you know, they're all different, those bloody machines. They are now. On the side. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But I think the good thing about it is since COVID, mm. it, it, anything that's over $100, I don't know what the limit is, but, you know, it used to be if it was over 100 you used to have to do the card and then um, put the number in. Put put your number in yeah, and you yeah. don't have to do that anymore. No. Mm. So, um, yeah, so I'm there and I go to pay and I'm doing it wrong <laughs> and the checkout chick says to me, you know, strip down. And anyway, by the time I realised that they were talking about my credit card, it was too late. You would. 
You'd go like that. I can imagine you. She'd say, strip down. You'd go, oh, all right. <laughs> yeah. You think about it for a second and think, well, if, that's if what, you say so. If that's what they want, you know, if they, yeah. that will bring them joy for the day. Yeah. I'm happy to oblige. Get your girls out. That's right. That's right. In woolies. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. Here's cheers to stripping mm. down. Mm. My garlic mm. wine mm. is starting to repeat on me a little mm. bit. Yeah. No. <laughs> I think it's time for you to go and cook me dinner now. Yeah. Right. I might wrap this one up. Because you want dinner. Would you like to touch my horn? <laughs> it's a bit soft. It is a bit soft, sorry. It's erect, though. It is, but it's a bit floppy. It's a floppy erect mm. horn. Nah, haven't we all had one of those? Oh, okay. Anyways. <laughs> okay. Anyways. Have a great night, everybody. Oh, oh, oh my yeah, turn. Yeah, you're doing my it. My turn. <laughs> I got I got my hands banging on the table under me backside or under my front side. You're joining. That sounds good. And your well, front I'm not, side. I'm not I'm not masturbating. I'm just got my hands under my thighs. Just <laughs> got my hands tucked into me girly bits. But yep. I'm not masturbating. No, I suppose I could put them under my boobs. Oh, that's the warmest. Oh, bit. Do you remember so doing that with your kids? Yes. I don't know if anyone else did this, but we both did this with our little kitties when mm. they were <clears throat> weans. Mm. And they had freezing fingers. Mm -hmm. And you go, here, put it under here. And you lift the girls up. Yep. Put the hand under. Put the girls back down. Yeah. Oh, oh. And, and when they were really little, and that that was fine. Because yep. that was, you know, they didn't know. Boobs, yeah. boobs were just what they used for nutrients. That's right. So put your hand under and they go, oh, it's so snuggly. Yes. And then came that day where they said, hey, my, my, boob, my hand under your boob. Yeah. Mm. No, fine, fuck off and have cold hands then. No. <coughs> I'll put my own under there. I do too. <laughs> I do too. Oh, it's so, oh, so, so warm. Oh, look, I'm doing a Dwayne Johnson. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> unassisted Dwayne Johnson. Oh, it's totally assisted. Oh, yeah. <laughs> see that? That's not unassisted. Mm. 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 Can see it? Can see it? I used, no. to, I used to be able to do that with oh, a little oh, bit. You can a little bit. Used to be my party trick. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. We've got to let these fine people um, go now. It's oh. on the table. We can both do it. Let's finish it with um, strobe light. That's right. <laughs> Please you understand my sign language. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's usually me that has, has no words. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody. Okay. Stay safe. Love is love. Oh, Subscribe. Yeah. Like. Follow. Tell your friends. Yes. And you can do that by sharing. Yes. Press the share button. Oh, that's boring now. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bye, everybody. Bye. Love yous. Bye.